Hey guys, Monster Mike here. And today's video, I wanna show you guys how to make a DIY Monstera themed bouquet. I hope this video helps somebody out. Um, I love it because for a few things, you know, um, I love saving money. Um, this, this is, anytime you make your own bouquet, it saves a lot of money. Um, also, I get to put my own personal theme in it. Uh, I get to add a Monstera. Um, anyways, let's get to it. Okay, this is the Monstera I will make a cutting from today to make my DIY themed uh, bouquet, Monstera bouquet. Now, I recently made a cutting here, and for those of you, those of you who are curious, the uh, what it does is it causes the plant to make a new growth here. So, there's a new leaf. Today, I'm going to cut. I'm thinking about cutting this part right here. When you want to make a cutting, you need to cut. Make sure there's a node involved. So I'm gonna cut right below the node here. This should shoot out roots. Now, the reason why I chose this is because it's kind of going out of the pot, but these are some of the nicest leaves on the plant as well. See that? And this one. I got all the supplies gathered now. I showed you um, where I get my um, filler from the front yard. So uh, the fillers are from the front yard. Uh, the Monstera, uh, the cutting is from my own personal Monstera. I had to actually cut it again because just the, the, the odd shape leaf, uh, it was sitting like this. And so I wanted, I like this one. And also, I still have the note here, so it will be a new plan sometime soon. The fillers from the front of my yard. We have my wife's favorite lilies, and they haven't even bloomed yet, so they smell really great when they're blooming. I got these from Tom Thumb. These are called spray roses. And they're just smaller, but I wanted to try something different this year. So we'll see how this works out. All in all, I've spent $15. The flower, the lilies and the roses cost about 15 bucks. I got the fillers from my front yard, the Monstera from my own personal plant collection. This vase even is handy. I reuse it every year. Um, so yeah, I mean, this is kind of the way to go. Save some money. Um, and then you'll have more plant money to buy more plants, right? First, I want to start with the center of the, of the, here we go. I want to start with the center. And since my wife's favorite flowers are lilies, I'm going to put those in the middle. Now we're going to fill around it. Don't worry if the, the flowers and roses are off, center, or, uh, not the same length, it's okay. Once everything's in there, it will hold itself up and you can just adjust it as you go. So these are the shorter ones and they're pink. I'm gonna put them on this side here. In front, in the front here, see how that looks, okay. Kinda like to have the staggered look as well. So you see the lilies are popping up on top here. Now, these will probably go in between the lilies and the shorter stem roses here, so kind of have that layered look like I was telling you about. If, if you feel this is too short, you can always kind of scoot them up a little bit. Once we got all the flowers in there, they'll stay, they'll stay in their spots. All right. These handy fillers that came from a front yard that cost me absolutely nothing. Let's put one on this side here. Kind of give it a little pop. See that? Let's add this one to the other side. Right here. Let that pop 
for this side. That. And this one, I'll just add to the back. So this is what we have so far. All right, now the centerpiece, the Monstera. I'm gonna put this, since it's so tall, I'm gonna go ahead and put it in the back. I dropped the monstera back there, so it's kind of peeking. But I'm pretty happy with the way this looks. I really like it. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, at this point, just add the plant food and some good water, and you're pretty much done. So there it is, one last time. Let me know what you guys thought about this bouquet. Um, I'm not a professional at all, so I mean, I, I think it's kind of fun to do um, do, your, do it yourself. So um, let me know what your thoughts are. Is it ugly? Is it pretty? And also let me know if you guys, if some of you guys are actually gonna take this idea and run with it. Thanks a lot for tuning in guys. Have a good one. Happy Valentine's Day.